Hi, this is Frank Music on the Live and Lost Black Boot Tour. I've got to do five dates over the space of ten days. I've only got my MySpace, my MySpace app, and my Blackberry to help me do it. Let's make it happen. I'm pretty close to home now. I think that's what agitates me more, is knowing how close I am. I don't have a lift tomorrow. He's walking to Norwich. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Is that Amy? Yes, it is. Hi, this is Vince from Frank Music. Hi, how are you? I'm right, how are you? It's going to be uh, a bit boring for me having him uh, gone. We, because I'm going to have nothing to do. I don't do anything. It's a bit of shit. Hey, how are you doing? You right? Okay, cool. Well, I'll, I'll see you outside Lloyd's Bank. Thank you. So we're looking for a guy in a cowboy suit, uh, shirt and um, suit, that would be awesome. And um, she's looking for um, the mess that is me. How are you doing, you alright? Hey. Meet you. I've just woken up. That's alright, you late <laughs> We're going to Cambridge, because that's as far as I can go today, because I'm avoiding a Freud essay. And I was like, Freud essay? 5,000 words, Frank Music. Well, it wasn't a hard choice, really. Uh, well, Amy kindly has um, driven us from Birmingham down to um, some service station. We are in a lot of trouble. I'm deliberating whether it's work, if, it, if we're able to get to Norwich to do the Tinsley Strider gig. Amy might have a crazy plan, um, but <laughs> with that, like, that, with that's kind of pushing things slightly. Things have sort of gone from bad to amazing! Oh my god, it's ringing! Oh my god, it's ringing! We're heading off to a cottage 20 minutes outside of Norwich. I think she thinks that we're all crazy because she has no idea what's going on. I just called her and said, Can three boys stay at your house, please? And she said yes, so it's going to be interesting. I'm, I'm calling Tinchy. Tinchy Strider! I'm basically in a car with a lady called Amy who's picked, who's picked me up from Birmingham and has is, is been kind enough to drive me to Norwich. I've had an idea. What are you up to this evening? Tinchy Strider! Are you up for doing a little PA? Yep, it's just outside Norwich. Super, so I'll give you a call when I hit Norwich and then we'll meet up, okay? That was Tinsy Strider. Um, lovely, lovely chap. And he's just agreed to do a little performance at Amy's friend's house. In a cottage. This is Live and Lost. Believe. I have a lovely memento of me and Amy. Say hi, Amy. Hello. Uh, Amy um, likes to um, have a bit, of, have a bit of road rage. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. See what I mean? Who's right of way was that? Ah. I just want, I just want Amy to touch my knee. But she won't. Free music. We're going to Norwich, but not just any Norwich. A Norwich that is inhabiting me tonight, Tinsley Strider tonight, Amy, the nutter. Or oh, oh, me, a little bit of me. Next time it'll be high if you ain't shut up. <laughs> going to do two gigs today and tonight at midnight at Optic. And we're going to be doing your friend's cottage this after evening. Super turnaround for the book. And um, yeah, things couldn't be better. We're here in Norwich where my friend Nicole has decided to put up Frank Music and me, obviously. Um, we've got a nice selection of snacks here and everything was going swimmingly until um, Vince seemed to disappear somewhere. I think that shape there might be him. So much for rock and roll. <laughs> How are you feeling? Alright. I just need to have a shower, I haven't had one for three days. My spider sense tells me that Tinchy isn't coming to the cottage. <laughs> We've got to go to, what is it called? Optic. Optic. 
We go to Specsavers <laughs> and do a gig. They have karaoke at Optic. They have karaoke at Optic. Should be good for me and Tinchy. <laughs> <laughs> Tinji Strider did an interview in Super Super Magazine about a year and a half ago. He said he wanted to work with me. So I took him up on the offer. I had the chance to do four tracks with him that I'm, we produced, um, I produced over the space of the past year. And yeah, really, you know, super great guy to work with, super talented, very friendly, very professional. The gentleman of grime, I call him. What's the music? Good to see you, man. See you. Live and Lost gigs, for me, um, although I'm on my last one, They've never really felt like challenges, they felt like sort of checkpoints, that I, objectives that I've had to complete. Um, doing the fifth one with Tinchy's um, lovely. Really good that I, I, I get the opportunity to do that sort of on a final send off before the single launch. And yeah, they felt great, they've all been varied and the best thing about them is that they were all put on by the fans. So um, yeah, that's as good as it possibly could be I think really. Five, five Blackberry gigs being organised by my Space fans, amazing. I've just kind of got on with it, knuckled down and d done what needed to be done. I haven't really had time to relax like I wanted to, you know, like you would on a normal tour. I've done a science museum to um, a pretty quiet night in Norwich with Tinji Strider, you know. It's been a real diverse culmination of creative hot potness and, uh, you know, put on and coordinated by the fans. Absolutely incredible. Um, it makes you think like how much people can do with just a little bit of push. Yeah, it's been it's been a wonderful experience. And I you know, the journey ahead is now my single launch, the, the sort of climax as it were to to to, to all of this. Thoroughly, thoroughly mad experience that I'm not gonna forget for a long time. Um, it's, it all seems like a blur now. I'll probably pick up the pieces, you know, afterwards and, you know, get some perspective. But it's hard to get perspective when I'm still doing this. This is happening now still. I've still got to get to London one way or another.